So a lot of installations are going to require getting your car up on jack stands and or removing the wheels. So in this video I'm going to go ahead and do both and that way for any of my installation videos I can go ahead and start with the car either on jack stands or with the wheels off or whatever I need to do in order to get started. So we're going to be getting the front of the vehicle up on jack stands so the first thing we're going to do is chalk the rear wheels. Make sure that's good and snug. Next we're going to set the emergency brake. And if you were lifting up the rear of the car, you would just put it in gear or in uh, park. So before we start to lift it up, we're going to go ahead and loosen the lugs on the front wheels. Next we're going to put our jack stands next to the uh, side uh, jacking points and you always want to make sure you've got jack stands that are rated at a capacity greater than your vehicle. So on my Integra uh, the jack point uh, behind the front tire is right here so this is what we're going to be trying to put our jack stand underneath. So next you want to locate the front jacking point and uh, that should be in your owner's manual so here on the Integra it's just this little plate right here which is connected to the frame. So we're going to slide a jack underneath that. Okay, so now we've got it under the jacking point and we can start lifting it up. Uh, once again, you want to make sure you've got a jack that's rated above the capacity uh, of the weight of your car. So once you've got it lifted up high enough, you can put the jack stands underneath and adjust them to the height so that they'll be just underneath the uh, jacking point and of course do that on both sides so next step you can slowly lower uh, your jack and let the frame of the car rest on the jack stands So you're going to want to inspect your jack stands, make sure everything's right, make sure that it's holding the vehicle, uh, it's all snug. Check that on both sides and unless I'm going under the vehicle, I just go ahead and I leave the jack uh, holding up the front of the car just as an extra precaution. So now that we've got it up on jack stands, we can go ahead and remove the lug nuts. And sometimes your wheel might be rusted on there a little bit, so you might have to give it a kick. Um, but then you can just simply remove the tire, slide it away, and you're good to go. So we're going to go ahead and loosen up the lug nuts. After loosening uh, both sides, uh, the rear lug nuts, you want to make sure you go ahead and chalk the front wheels when you jack this up. Okay, so we've got the car in gear and we've got the wheel chocks in front of the front wheels. And this is our rear jacking point, so we're just going to lift that up. So once you've got it raised up, you can go ahead and slide the jack stands up underneath the mounting points which are right in front of the rear tires. Um, and then you can get those to the right position and then kind of lower it down onto those jack stands. Okay, so now that we've got the wheels uh, up in the air, the vehicle up on jack stands, we can go ahead and remove uh, the rear wheels, taking out these four lug nuts. <laughs> 